What we do here is go back, 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 back. I have no idea what nails I'm gonna get, actually. It is Friday. I could not be more excited. I mean, I'm always excited for Friday, but like especially this week, we have a bunch of fall things planned and I have some self-care activities to do this weekend. So I'm really excited. I just finished work. It's 1.43. I drove to the nail salon because I have no nails <laughs> and I need to get my nails done. So that's the first thing that I'm gonna do on my self-care weekend. Um, what else do we have going on this weekend? Uh, we're going, oh, Alex and I are going to the rage cage tonight, which I hope I can get some videos. I think it's gonna be really cool. I've been before with my best friend. We were having a real hard time with just life and like everything and we wanted to break stuff. So the two of us went and we did axe throwing and the rage cage, which if you've never been or if you've never heard of it before, it's basically like this giant room that's got drywall and like metal plates on it, or at least the one that I've been to. And you get to go like shopping in their little section and you pick up plates and bowls and a bunch of stuff and you basically get to go in this room like all padded up and break everything with sledgehammers and shovels and it's really fun so i'm very excited to be able to get to do that again and i think alex and i could really use like a chance to blow off some steam like that so that's the plan for tonight we actually because we felt like we needed it so badly we postponed our costco trip we were gonna do that today after work, but we decided we're gonna do it tomorrow. Um, what else? I wanna go to the market with Alex because he hasn't come with me in a while and I kinda like walking around there with him and looking at stuff and it's, I don't know, it's just kinda cozy vibes. And that store that we went to last time, I really wanna show him because it's really cool and has a lot of gluten-free stuff. So I'm gonna try and do that this weekend too. Um, I wanted to take Boba for a nice walk uh, with Marissa and Alex and go into this forest area here in Montreal. Um, I don't really know how to explain it. It's in a residential area in the city, but it's absolutely gorgeous. It's like a giant patch of forest and it's really nice, a lot of people go there to kind of it's not really a hike but like to go for like a nice walk um and a lot of people go with their dogs I think they're allowed off leash at some point I will not let Boba off leash at all but I'm sure he'll meet some puppies and have some fun and I don't know I'm just trying to be more creative with things that we can do for self-care and things that would be fun during a pandemic because right now because of everything that's going on Montreal is in a red zone again, so we all have to be really careful and we'll all, we're all, we are all quarantined again. Um, they said until the 28th of this month, but we all know it's probably gonna get postponed. I mean, we don't know yet, so we wait to find out. So things like going on walks and being able to socially distance from people, going to a nail salon and being super, super safe. I wear a mask. There's a visor I already called ahead and like, I've been here before she always sanitizes like the stations and she's very very good at all that so i feel really comfortable and we go in whenever we go grocery shopping which is inevitable um we always make sure to wear proper protocol which would be a mask and i have goggles and things like that so 
Anyway, I wanted to take you all along on this weekend. I feel like we're gonna do some fun stuff and I'm excited. So we just finished dinner. We had breakfast for dinner. Alex and I are heading out to go to the Rage Cage. And these are my finished nails. Monkey, do you like them? I love them. Where are you? Oh, you no, like don't show me. Oh. Alex's first rage cage experience. Yeah. How was it? It was good. It was good. I'm still angry afterwards, though. It's good. What was your favorite part? Uh, that uh, uh, skateboard Wii electronic device mm -hmm. that the, uh, the 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 rage cage guy said, "Okay, try this out." Because nobody ever used it. Yeah. yeah, he said it had been there forever, and he's like, honestly, he's like, I stare at it and I want to snatch it. Yeah, it was so much fun. It was really good. Yeah, that that was that was the best. I think I think, I think we should like just bring like uh, our own stuff next time. That'd be fun. Uh, we don't need the small stuff. A tire would be fun. One hour. Literally, a tire would be so much fun. You would just like yeah. go off on the tire. There's archery there. That's nice. Archery would be fun. Archery. I'm glad we went. Archery, yeah. Archery is like very relaxing, but not like rage. <laughs> It was definitely what we needed tonight. And then Alex went and got us a, what is it? Matcha. Matcha with matcha pudding or jelly? Jelly. Jelly, no sugar, extra large. And then, oh my God, he surprised me with this and I'm obsessed. Alex, what is this? Pumpkin spice boba. Like, no sugar. I love you so much. Does it, does it taste like pumpkin? Mm -hmm. Should I have gotten some other kind of topping in there? Mm-mm. Mm. -mm. mm. There's like a coconutiness to it. It's really good. Yeah. So we um, are having date night. Yeah. Thank you. For people who don't know, that's like a very Canadian, very Quebec um, food. It's basically French fries with curd cheese and then this amazing gravy on top. So he really loves the Costco one. So he's gone in to get one of those. And it's really hard now that there's no samples in Costco because you're not eating. So then you want to buy the food on your way out. Because usually when you go to Costco, you get all the samples and it's basically a meal. So. He's inside getting that. We've got a new rug. Then we got puppy pee pee pads. We got a boot tray. There's a bunch of water. And then I'll show you what is in the trunk. We've got breads, we've got chips, coconut oil, literally everything. So I'll do a mini haul when we get home. But that's pretty much the trip. this time um, sort of my go-to so I thought I'd do like a mini Costco haul of my favorites to show you guys um, so number one on that list we got a whole thing of almond flour which I'm very excited because I haven't been able to bake since I started my gluten-free sugar-free all of that fun stuff so because I was waiting to get this and I was waiting for the next Costco haul because this is so expensive to get like the little bags at the grocery store it's almost the same price as this so I was waiting to get this. I was also waiting to get this coconut oil because this is supposed to be really good to cook with and really good to bake with. 
and this whole thing was $17. Whoops. This is my favorite marinara sauce. What's in here? It's low sugar, a high vitamin A, lots of good stuff, but it also tastes so good. So I got four of them because I was really, actually I thought they ran out at first and I was really upset. But when I found out that they still had them, I was like, I want to stock up. So I got four. So we got that. I obviously got two hummuses because this with sweet potato crackers, which I also got. Then this bag are one of my new go-to snacks. We got our favorite brick of cheese, which is Balderson. I got these two kinds of Choco or Choc XO snacks. This one's an almond butter cup, sort of like a Reese's, I guess. And this is a dark chocolate coconut almond and sea salt bite. These are so good for on the go or just like to satisfy my sweet tooth. Then because I can't have a lot of pastas and stuff, I love ramen. We got this, which is brown rice and millet ramen. So I don't think it has any packages of like seasoning, but my sister found that there's like a website you can get recipes from. So I'm going to look into that. And then I am very excited for this. It was $40. <laughs> but it's a heated throw blanket. And burgundy is one of my favorite colors. I think this is gonna look really good on the gray couch that we have. And it has like four settings of heat and it has like an automatic turn off like setting. So I'm really excited. I think this will be perfect. That's the line. We are at the park going for a walk. And the pictures. started eating before I started recording. Marissa's having it where we split a sandwich and we're gonna go to the market after. It's 10 o'clock. We came home after going to the market and then Costco again because we needed to get her a winter coat. Guys, can <laughs> I bought her a heated blanket and I bought her a winter coat and she wanted ice cream. It's so really she good. got ice Costco cream. Costco has like the best ice cream. I don't know. It's really good. Also, unpopular opinion, she only gets vanilla. Like, I like when chocolate. she gets the swirl, she only gets vanilla, no chocolate. Yeah, once I got the swirl with vanilla and chocolate, I didn't like it. Mm. Just vanilla. So while we were at the market, we actually picked up two like medium sized pumpkins that we're gonna carve and then we're gonna roast the pumpkin seeds because those are so good. I haven't done that since I was a kid. So we're gonna do that and watch the second Halloween Town because we watched the first one last night and we wanna watch all four of them before Halloween, which is next week. So that's what we're gonna do. I just finished editing the video that you just saw and I realized that there was no outro so I didn't want to leave it off with the pumpkins so I thought I would come on and say thank you so much for watching I would love it if you subscribed comment like this video and I hope I know I'm posting this after Halloween but I hope you all had a very happy and safe Halloween